You're the Inquisitor. I hear your people already sing songs of you. How are you so well informed? Oh, Helstim soaks up gossip when he goes trading. He just returned from the lowlands. I'm Fulna Hethstotten, keeper of histories and skull to the hold. I've never met a scald. Is that anything like a bard? I suppose. Every hold has someone who sings its songs. Doesn't yours? Fair enough. We keep the old songs and histories, the oaths and the legend marks. I understood all of that except legend mark. The skald before me was born Gulda Elsdotten. She crafted a great new tale for the hold. It pleased the spirits. After that, we called her Gulda Gildan's song. So they're titles, honorifics. Not all carry glory. My father was Heth Mule's head. <sighs> He'd never let go of a quarrel. Can you choose a legend mark for yourself? <sighs> only if I wanted to be scorned as a child. I've only been a scold a few years. I've not made any great feats, good or ill. Yet. Farewell. Good journeys. Uh, welcome. So long as their weapons stay sheathed. Be welcome, Inquisitor. Though I fear I've time for little more than a greeting. I must prepare these souls for their greater journey, particularly those who depart without the reverence due. Their way is often hardest. I'm not familiar with Avar funerals. May I ask what proper rites entail? When the time comes, we are given sky burials. For most, the body is laid out and prayers given. When the birds come, they carry the soul to the Lady of the Skies. The body, unneeded is gone for most some souls such as Colden's are chosen to return the auger reads the signs of birth it is a rare honor in order to return an offering is made to Korth the mountain father and buried beneath the body a piece of the soul thus remains allowing the rest to return to this world and be reborn Someone not be given proper rights? Calden Enverson is one of the few whose soul may return. Bloodkin must make an offering to the Huntmaster who prepares it. Or so it should be. Calden's son, Finn, has failed in this duty, but then there's you. Me? You're a guest of our hold. A gift from you cannot be refused. Even an offering for Calden. I cannot dictate the nature of a gift, but if my suggestion appeals to you, speak to the Huntmaster. I should be on. Lady, keep you. Satchin is good. Fine work. Greetings, stranger. Our guests are welcome. So long as their weapons stay she.
Our guests are welcome. Thatching is good. Fine work. Inquisitor, I'm honored by your visit. I'm Finn Col... Um... Finn Caldenson. Forgive me if I don't stand to greet you properly. How were you injured? A storm blew up a few months back. It's the worst we've seen in a while. I was helping to secure the fishing boats. Einar nearly fell in. I caught him, but the current caught me. My leg got crushed against the rocks. It hasn't set properly. I know about your father's burial. And the offering. I tried. I dragged myself out of this cursed bed, but the pain... I collapsed. The Huntmaster found me and dragged me back. He said we didn't need another dead man. I'm told I can make the offering as a gift for the hold. I'll try to do so for your father. He won't be my father much longer. What do you mean? I can't make the offering. When the sky burial's complete, I, I'll lose the right to bear my father's name. Whether or not he's my father, I still love him. I would not see his soul severed from the earth if it's meant to return. If you can make a gift of the offering, there's no way I could repay you. I'll let you rest. Lady, keep you. Inquisitor, you've need of a hunter, or you're just wandering. Doubt you lowlanders see many holds, but I'll tell you, there are none finer. I assume you go hunting yourself. Of course I do. Who says otherwise? But no one. I lead our hunts, Inquisitor. My leg aches, one eye can't see in the dark, and I bring more meat than anyone in the hold. Goat's piss do I hunt. I apologize. I was just curious. <laughs> Suppose you can't help Lowlander's manners. I spoke to the woman preparing...